hello 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 good morning to everyone who is viewing this i hope all is well i am very tired as you can see we've got a shopping bags under the eyes at the moment oh uh, it was my first shift at my new job and let's just say <coughs> the weather weren't on my side and a tree fell on the train track so it made me delayed by half an hour 45 minutes which didn't thrill me in the slightest but anyway it's not too bad a bit of a sunset over there not too shabby not too shabby i must say we're letting the beard grow again there because it's bulking season beard time just to cover up the potential fat face what we'll approach but um, just currently on the morning walk, the pre-gym walk, as we all call it. Um, yeah, to, on today's agenda is push, but it's chest dominant. So four chest exercises, um, one shoulder, and one tricep. And obviously the one tricep exercise will be something like a, a cable push down, and the shoulder one will be like a side raise, just to top up those medial delts. But can try our best to annihilate chest and I think I might be doing a bar incline barbell press which is the first time in a very long time so I'm excited to try that Marvel wrong way when I talk to you guys on the phone at ah, Marvel listen he tries to take the piss all the time the minute I don't focus on him he drives me on a bloody wall Oh yeah, I'm excited to do that. I've had my eye. I've been thinking about the last 24 hours, like going through the movement in my head. Like, do you know what? I'll try it. Let's see how the shoulder holds up. Obviously, if it goes tits up, then we'll go on to a incline dumbbell, incline swiffle machine. Regardless, it'll be an incline because you need that upper shelf, the upper chest. Yeah, I've got to stack something on there. Yeah, it's not bitches. I think I'll be stacking on there is tears, like a puddle of tears on the upper chest. But yeah, let's see what today brings. Hopefully today is a better day than yesterday overall. Marvel, real way, come on bro. Speak to you guys soon. Hi guys, so hope all is well. I'm doing this voiceover whilst being on a gym shift, so bear with me. It might be a bit noisy in the background or whatever, but start of this chest dominant push day was some dips done four sets here and these felt really good the pump on my chest today was adorable cringy but cute at the same time saying that so the rep range was between about 15 to 20 for most parts of it this was the fourth set i recorded out of four sets and where's the elbow sleeves today just see i thought i would get on with them and done some incline barbell like i said i would and I was happy, I, I felt I felt unnatural in that position, but it's been such a long time. And I'll definitely be sticking to incline barbell for a long period of time until obviously either fatigue on the weight or it doesn't feel the same, but I really enjoyed it and I'll be sticking with it. And I'm really weak at these. Like I used to be able to shift a decent amount of weight, but for not doing it a long period of time, I'm weak, but you look, you can see me shaking just from 60 kilos. It's bad, it's embarrassing for me. Then after that, went into some dead stop version. So, dead stop essentially on the rack. So, just to teach me to be a bit more explosive, sitting deep naturally, rest pulls, and explosive on the way out, as explosive as possible. And once again, these felt really nice. What I'm saying is whilst like rubbing my upper chest at the same time, surely everyone does that, am I right? But um, went into a drop set after this, so when I mean a drop set, just took a few plates off each side um, and then just went back under the bar and did as many as possible. But I used to do, I used to do this exercise probably like three, four years ago and it felt good at the time and I don't know why I stopped it. It's all this like bro science stuff in it, but just go to what works for you go back to the OG ways of training and that's what I've done and I've noticed a lot of other people in the fitness industry are doing that as well and it's good to see it's good to see but I hope everyone is having a good start to the new year I'd like to think I'm having a good start 
apart from London tube services, suck dick and the English weather sucks dick. Yeah, what else is there to say really about it all? But I'm looking forward to training tomorrow, which is my back and hamstrings workout. My whole workout is predominantly around deadlifting, as per usual, you know the drill. I'm excited, man. I'm loving training every day. I'm waking up, well, hours after finishing just this workout, for example. I'm thinking about the next session. And then to finish off the pump was some cable flyers. I like to call these like Arnold version, Arnold-esque. Because if you ever watch Pumping Iron, these are like the flyers he does in there. And a really good stretch on my chest. You can see the stretch and the activation in my pectoral muscles. This feels nice, really good. So I've done three sets here. First set was about 20 to 30 reps, 25 to 30 reps roughly. Ridiculously light. My strength is slowly going up and I am noticing that, so it's good. But this was a heavier set, so for example, the first set was using 10 or 12.5 kilos. This was about 15 or 17.5 kilos roughly. And this was a, you know, this was a demanding set. And I like it. I'm just trying to bring that leg intensity into my upper body workouts. Look at me, praying to Jesus. Thinking, fuck me, man. Oh, rub the titties. Then went in some cable crossovers for some triceps. Get a full range of motion on them. Two sets here. 15 to 20 reps, roughly, I think. I think. The first set was definitely. Second set might have been less reps. But... Now you can see good activation in my triceps and everything. Felt every exercise in all the right places. No niggles in the wrong places. So I'm happy. I'm a happy man when it comes to... If I've had a good workout, it sets me up for the rest of the day. I don't know how everyone else feels, but if you have a good workout, the rest of the day is good. That's the way I look at it. And when I can't do any full reps, just pump the odd one or two of half reps. And then the last exercise of the day was some dumbbell side raises. For some reason, this camera angle makes my chest, just the upper body, look wham. Wham meaning big. But I'm not. I'm a skinny little boy, weighing 182 pounds at 6 foot 1. But no, overall, I'm really happy with today's workout. So two sets of dumbbell side raises, just get a nice little pump on those medial delts. Keep a bit of blood in there. Um, I think the rep range was about 15, 20 reps, roughly. I do love a high rep range. I do love it. But yeah. Not much else to say really, just gonna drop a bit of a physique update in a second. But yeah, I'll sign out now. So everyone have a lovely morning, have a lovely afternoon, have a lovely evening, whatever it is you're doing. And until next time, it will be, like I said, a back and hamstrings workout. So adios amigos.